and welcome to a new video here on my channel. You guys have probably seen that there is a new launch from Anastasia Beverly Hills called Norvina Palette Volume 2. Here it is. You guys know I just did a first impression on Volume 1. I have no idea how Anastasia makes their products and launches them like so quickly. So as always, I am of course going to create a makeup look with this whoop, with this amazing eyeshadow palette and uh, we're just gonna have a lot of fun. And not only that, this video is actually in collaboration with Shopping for Net, which is a shopping website online where you can find pretty much whatever you want. I have a bunch of their lenses, their fresh look color blend. I can see clearly without lenses so these are just for fun and for color but you guys know i struggled so much with these like halloween lenses to put them in my eye but these ones are so thin they are not at all like the ones that you get from like a halloween store or anything like that so i'm gonna choose one of these ones and then we are going to create a look with the anastasia beverly hills novena palette and we're just gonna have also, before we start, I just wanted to say that if you guys are interested in lenses like these or anything else on Shopping for Net, you can use my coupon code Evelina15 for 15% off. And also, if you guys are feeling lucky, go ahead and check them out on Instagram because they are now celebrating 20 years, so they will have a lot of fun competitions and giveaways and probably really good coupon codes, so go ahead and check them out if you guys are interested. I guess it is time to choose what kind of eye color I should have in this look. I have a gray shade, which looks really, really cool. This one is called Honey. We have a turquoise, amethyst, brown. Ooh, you guys, I think we're going to take the last one right here. This is the green. I feel like green with my hair at the moment would look really, really cool in this background. So let's put these in. So here I go, I'm just gonna open, whoop, I'm gonna take the lens like this and I'm gonna make it lay the right side so it doesn't hurt my eye. Both my big sisters use lenses every single day and my boyfriend does too, so I've seen them do this a hundred times, even though I'm really bad at it. And now I'm just gonna put it in and uh, hope for the best. Oh, shit. <laughs> that went way smoother than it usually does. And uh, although I feel like I can still feel them, but I think it's because I'm not used to lenses. Okay, and now for the, uh, what is this whole name? Pro Pigment Palette Volume 2. This, like the Volume 1, is also completely vegan, which is just amazing. Here are all of the shades and this shade is looking so interesting. It is called D1 and also this one at the top, that one called A4. They are like two colors in one pretty much. This is how they look. Although I think that just from seeing this palette it would be a shame if I didn't use one of the very colorful ones. And they have a lot of green in them. And I know I've just done a super green eyeshadow look, but I think I'm gonna use green. But I think that we're gonna go in with a two. It is like a mix between a lime green and a yellow. And we are gonna use this in the crease just for like a transition color. Hmm, ooh, R. <laughs> and then let's go in with B3, and then I'm gonna use E3 as well in the outer corner. And I did realize that I should have gone in with a eye primer, but I didn't, so. I'm just gonna layer this on my lid. That is such a cool shade. I'm using the worst brushes for this, and I am Sorry for that, but I need to clean my brushes. I am gonna do it after this. I promise, I promise, I promise. 
And now for a little bit of C4. I hope it has a green undertone. I think it looks like that. And I'm just gonna use it right in the crease. And then I'm gonna use the matte black for just a little bit more intensity. And now I'm gonna go in with the eye primer, also from Anastasia Beverly Hills, and we are going to cut our crease. If I can, <laughs> this is probably the one thing that I am really, really bad at when it comes to makeup, but I'm just gonna give it a go and hope for the best. <laughs> um, should we do a blue C4? in the outer corner, then a little bit of B4, B5, and then I'm gonna finish it off with C2. I don't know if this was a bad idea, <laughs> but whatever, I'm gonna go in with the yellow shade. I know I always use yellow in the inner corner, but it's because it looks the best. So I have these eyeliners from Suva Beauty called Dance Party and Fanny Pack. And I'm thinking we should use those. Let's go in with the green one called Fanny Pack. I had a little bit of a panic attack <laughs> because I felt like the entire look was ruined. But I am back and I'm just going to go in with the uh, Dance Party instead. And I have layered Dance Party on top of the lime green. And now I'm just going to use it a little bit here in the inner corner. And I don't know if this will be like my most aesthetic look and perfect look, but at least it will be a fun look. And now underneath my eyes, I am again going to go in with C4, E3 and B3. And now before I blend a little bit more, I am going to go in with some liner and now some liner here as well. For lashes, I'm gonna go in with the Nirvana lashes from Rouge and & Rogue. And now for bottom lashes, I'm just gonna put one right here. Now for lips, this has been my favorite lip to go. Lip to go? <laughs> my new favorite product of all time. It is the Milk Makeup Lip and Cheek Tint in Work. And all I do is I just push, push? Put this all over my lips. And then I go in with the Nabla Velveteen in Jolie. And I just overline a little bit. And then the last step is to use the Fenty Beauty Pro Kisser Lip Balm. This gives such a nice glow. I know I panicked a little bit in the middle of this video. But now I think it looks actually really, really cool. I think that as soon as I did the uh, green underneath my eyes, I felt like it turned green again. I think that, and don't quote me on this, <laughs> but I think that the shade E3 made the look look a little bit muddy for some reason. Also, some thoughts. I think that the 4, the yellow one, was pretty, but it just wasn't as pigmented as I would have hoped. It's more like a mellow yellow, but the shade B3, B4, and B5 was amazing. Okay, those are super pigmented, so I'm super excited to try those out as well. Also, I'm really excited to use a one that looks really pretty, and I really wanna use the one that I swatched first. Also, I wanna swatch this one, I think. The shiny, pink one super pretty and these are the like highlight shade kind of i think the green shades were a bit tricky to blend together but i do know that i've had that problem with uh green before but as always with the anastasia beverly hills palettes i always like them and i always use them you guys know the anastasia beverly hills palettes the like regular original ones are my most used palettes ever and I actually really, really enjoy these Norvina palettes. So yeah, that is it. Before I end this video, I just wanted to say a huge thank you to Shopping Fournette and these lenses. I love them so much. I think they look so cool. If you guys want to see more pictures of the other lenses, go to my Instagram where I will have some stories and Instagram posts. So yeah, that is it. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope that we will see each other in the next video. Bye guys.